and boom just like that apple stock purchased what's up everyone if you're new to the investing world you've still probably heard about robin hood all the buzz about robin hood and their platform has been really something the reason so many people are turning to robin hood is because of their no fee platform and i'm going to be diving right into that in today's video in this video we're going to be looking at the pros of robin hood we're going to be looking at the cons my thoughts my experience all for you sit back and relax. So as I mentioned, the first pro of Robin Hood is definitely gonna be their no fee system. This is truly revolutionary because it's always been with all these brokerage accounts that you have to pay an entrance fee and an exit fee. What that means is no matter if you're buying one share of a stock or 10 shares, you have to pay a fee when you go in and sell the stock. And usually that fee is about five or six bucks. It may not seem like a lot, but this could really eat away at your profits tremendously. Especially if you're a newbie investor starting at very small, those minimal profits can really be taken away from you because of those fees. That's why so many people, it's like a cult following are turning to Robinhood. And another big pro is that there's no minimum, meaning you can fund your account with as little as one penny. Now before we even look into any other pros or cons, the first thing on your mind is probably gonna be, is this safe? You're probably wondering, is this some offshore broker that's really sketchy? And I was exactly thinking the same thing, but upon further research, they're actually SEC regulated and by the SIPC, Securities Investors Protection Corporation. With that protection, this means that you're insured up to $500,000 in securities and $250,000 in cash, which is essentially the same thing you'd find with any other brokerage account out there. They're US-based and there's really nothing to worry about. They're gonna be around for a while and everything's 100% legitimate. Another nice little bonus is that you can get a free stock for signing up with someone. So yes, I have my referral link in the description if you're interested in something like that. All you have to do is open an account and you'll get a free stock, something in the range of usually five to 10 bucks. I get a free stock, you get a free stock. It's a win-win situation, but of course, it's 100% up to you. I'm gonna make them an offer they can't refuse. And once you sign up, of course, you'll get your own referral link where you could start actually recruiting people and getting free stocks. So you'll just have plenty of free stocks in your portfolio. Now let's get into some of the cons. Some of the cons are gonna be that you're not gonna be able to actually open up any other special accounts like a tax advantaged account like a Roth IRA or a traditional IRA. None of those accounts are available currently, but they might be in the future. That's okay with me because you can just easily open up one of those accounts with another broker. But probably the biggest, biggest con, especially from my standpoint and long-term investing, is that you can't do any drip or fractional shares. And I did a whole video on drip and its advantages and how you can actually build a full-time income just from dividend reinvestment. You could see that notification should be in one of these corners up here. This means that if you get a dividend from a stock, uh, you know, quarterly, you can't actually automatically reinvest that and you wouldn't be able to reinvest it anyways unless you had a massive, massive portfolio because you can't buy fractional shares. You have to buy one whole share. So let's say Apple is 200 bucks. You can't buy a fraction of it like you can with other brokerage accounts. Another thing I really didn't like was that you couldn't do an instant deposit over $1,000, which means that you can only do up to $1,000 instantly, but anything over that on the free Robinhood platform would actually take three to five business days for it to appear in your account. So what I did when I was first starting out and I played around with a little bit of money, I did my $1,000 instantly, but now I have a few thousand dollars pending. I did multiple transactions of 1,000. So if you are planning to start with a good chunk of money, you are gonna have to wait just a little bit for those deposits to clear. Now there is another option for you if you wanted that money right away and some other benefits. Robinhood has a gold level, which you can actually upgrade. And the cost of that is five bucks a month and it's 30 days free, so you get your first 30 days free, then $5 a month. This gold level will actually allow you to deposit up to $5,000 instantly, so you can have that cash right away, right readily available. And there's some other benefits, such as research data, and they'll also give you level two data, which means you could see live charts and instant trades right when they happen. At that gold level, you'll also be able to borrow margin, and you'll be able to buy with money that you don't have. But as a newbie investor, I wouldn't recommend doing this anyways. Robinhood is still working on certain things, like they just announced a savings account with a 3% annual interest rate, which is very exciting. Overall, my opinion of it is that it's very good for you know, quick trading if you are into that kind of thing. You don't have to pay those fees. It is very beneficial. But there are some things that might pull you back for the long-term investor or someone starting with a larger amount of money. But I definitely think it's a great way for newbies to get into investing, so I do recommend checking it out. Again, my link is in the description. You get a free stock with that. But other than that, I hope you enjoyed that video. I hope you got something out of it. If you did, be sure to smash that like button. And if you're not already, subscribe to the channel and hit that little notification bell so that way you're notified every time I get a new video. See you in the next one.